episode today for you. I have the single most important episode of this whole back to a brand new episode today for you. I have the single most important episode of this whole series. The moment I have been waiting. How's it going, buddy? The moment I have been waiting for forever. I'm going to fight the Ender Dragon. The only goal for today, the only goal on the checklist is to kill the beast herself. The Ender Dragon. And I can't wait. Hopefully, 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 uh, I'll be able to do it. <laughs> so today, what we're going to do is we're going to prep. Uh, we're going to get some new gear. And then we're going to go hunt her down. And that's the, what the whole episode is going to be dedicated to. So I am very excited. Hopefully you guys are as well. Let's begin our preparations. But, oh, 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 before, I do have some stuff to show you that I did. I've got an official trail to the spawner forest. So it's nothing too crazy, but it looks like this and it basically goes the whole way to the spawner. So here it is uh, up here. Yeah, it's just got some fences on the side, some bone mealed land, a, little, a few bushes here and there. But uh, yeah, that's the basic gist of it. I've also added a whole new chest room over here. So now we're up to uh, three different branches. So uh, that's good right there. And I I've also done a little bit of work on the interior of this house. I can't remember exactly what's new, but I'll give you guys a quick walkthrough and I'll show you uh, what's up. I still have a few different ideas that you guys uh, gave me in last episode that I do want to implement. Uh, I just haven't gotten around to it, but as you can tell, interior is starting to look pretty nice. And there are lighting glitches all over the place today. Not sure what that's about. Oh, also, I think this was like this last episode, but... But the animal farm is gone, and I've cleared the area for a new build. Not sure what I'm going to put here. If you guys have any suggestions, let me know. And I've also got a small update on the fishing, uh, the fishing neighborhood. So this house is complete, and I've also added a house over here. It's got some sort of small tower connected to it. Um, yeah, I don't know exactly what the inspiration was for this, but um, it's it's a pretty cool little uh, little room. Oh, and uh, yeah, there we go. Got up and. Uh, uh, the view is not too bad. So that is what that house looks like. And then the interior of this one is also uh, complete uh, for the most part. I've added a bed. I've got another fishing rod. I've also got a whole lot of lag. <laughs> I apologize. And uh, this is what the interior of, uh, of this place looks like. So uh, pretty cool. So now that we got all of that out of the way, I want to make a whole new set of tools. That's a new diamond sword. A new diamond pickaxe, a new diamond shovel, and a new diamond axe, I think is what I'm going to use here. Yeah, so new set of diamond tools. There we are. Lag is absolutely going bananas. We good? I also want to make a new bow, and I might enchant this, I might not. I have two that I've fished up that are really, really good, um, and I could just combine those. But the goal here is to make uh, insane tools, the best you can get, basically, uh, with my 42 levels and some of the books that I've already got. So, hopefully we can work this out. I'm going to get some of the, I got a ton of books here, I'm going to pick out the ones that I want to apply, uh, I'll be right back. Okay, so the these are the books that I might end up using, uh, but first what I want to do is uh, actually enchant. So let me grab a few of this lapis lazuli and uh, I think we're good to go. Oh, I also had a shovel in here. Jeez. <laughs> oh, whatever. Okay, so uh, let the games begin. Let's start off and we'll just throw everything in and see what we can get. So no, not Bane of Arthropods, please no. Uh, Fortune 3 could be good. I was hoping for Silk Touch because I want to use... Uh, my ender chest, so uh, fortune three on the shovel, and smite three on the axe. What about the bow? Flame one. You know what? Let's just do the fortune three. Should I? 
Okay, yeah, let's do the fortune three. And efficiency four, that is fantastic. So I'll have to get another uh, another one of my picks for Silk Touch, but that's fine. This is a great uh, diamond pickaxe. So next up, what we'll do is we'll just go back through this again. Smite four, do not want that. Uh, fortune two, not necessarily. Bane of Arthropods, no. <laughs> and what about this? Unbreaking three, I can do that. So we'll take Unbreaking three on the bow and get power four. So, uh, yeah, we can definitely combine these three to make a very, very good bow, which is exciting. And we can move on. Oh, how many more lapis? Oh, it's right here. Perfect. Um, and uh, let's get that in there. Silk Touch? Oh, so does that mean this will have Silk Touch? No, this will have Sharpness 3. I'm going to do Silk Touch on the shovel, and we get Efficiency 4, which is fantastic. And for the final uh, two enchantments, we have Smite 4, Sharpness 4, and Loading 3, which is incredible. Uh, and then we also have this, and I guess we could put Sharpness 4 and Efficiency 4. That's fine. So, uh, very, very good enchantments. And I also still have these books, so let me... Me go check those out. So, uh, because this does not help Silk Touch, what I will do really quick is make another diamond pickaxe, uh, and then we'll have to add a Silk Touch book. Now, this has Silk Touch. It's also got a few really other, uh, really good other enchantments. It kind of pains me that I'm only going to use this for Silk Touch, but uh, it's what's going to have to do. So, Silk Touch pickaxe, uh, Fortune 3 Efficiency 4 pickaxe, uh, and now what we can do is start using these. So, why don't we put fire aspect on the sword. Let's combine the bows really quick. So we're just going to combine them all and see. Unbreaking 3, Flame 1, Infinity 1, Power 5. Oh my goodness, this bow is miraculous. I can also combine this sword with another Sharpness 4 book to get Sharpness 5, which is insane. Uh, Silk Touch 1, Efficiency 4 book, uh, and that really can't be changed. So I think I'm done with the tools. Let's see if I need protection on armor. Uh, yeah. Yep, okay, so I'll do helmet and chest plate with the protection four book. I think that is the way to go. What? Wait a second. You can't do it. Oh, okay. So I can do it with that, but I can't override? I guess I can't override the fire protection. Interesting. So what about leggings? No. Uh, oh, I guess I don't need to use that book then. That's fine. So we've got a new diamond sword, a new bow, two, a set of really good picks, a pair of fantastic picks, a diamond shovel, and a new diamond axe. I'm going to go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll work on a few more preparation pieces. So so as you can see here, I've kept it quiet, but I've saved up a few ender pearls, and I've also got a good amount of blaze powder here. So I want to combine the blaze powder and the ender pearls to make, oh yes, I have enders. We're just going to do as many of these as we can. Uh, 22, not too bad. We've also got 16 ender pearls still, uh, not too bad either, and I think... That's all we need. On second thought, let me make uh, let me make ten golden apples. I think that's a good idea. So if I've got any extra gold, oh yeah, oh yeah, we can definitely do it. So put these apples in here, spread the love with the gold, and uh, we should be good to go. Yes, a ten golden apples. That is fantastic. So I was debating taking shade on this adventure, but I'm gonna leave him behind because. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I just feel like that's the best plan. Uh, I am walking in this direction, I believe. Now, everyone, a ton of people, a ton of people commented on an episode that was, uh, uh, it aired a few weeks ago, maybe, and I, it was the one where I found the abandoned village, and everyone was saying, hey, hey, did you see that blacksmith chest? There was a stone brick in there. That means there's a stronghold underneath, and I saw those comments, but I didn't want to reply because I wanted to make it a surprise. I wanted no one to think this would be the episode, but yes, this is the episode we're doing it. We are doing it, and I can't wait. So, if you guys were correct, I think the village is in this direction, so if I throw this up... Yup, oh my goodness, the lag is really bad. I apologize, but we're going this way. All right, see you over there. Uh, okay, I'm a little weirded out right now. I, I thought these would be taking me to that village. I walked to the village, and they pointed over here. 
So I'm not very far away at all. It only took me like five, ten minutes to walk here. Uh, and that's just casually walking on horseback. It would have been like two, three minutes. So I I'm very, I'm very confused. This is uh, not what I was expecting. I was expecting to go under that village. What might be the case is maybe that village uh, does in fact have a stronghold. It's just not the stronghold. That is probably the case. So... Um, let me just make sure, ah, I don't want to, no, I don't want to waste any more pearls. I don't want to waste any more pearls. I'm just going to go right down here, and hopefully I'll be able to, uh, to find this stronghold that's apparently right down here. A little concerned, though, because, uh, I'm not so sure how I feel about this. <laughs> I'm starting to get scared. Okay, 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 so we're in a cave here. Hello? How are you, Skeletor? Man, I'm scared. I'm so scared. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got this area up here. I don't think this is connected to anything, though. Oh! Would you look at this? Hello? Hey, zombie guys. Get out of there. Yo, yeah. All right, let me place a torch in here. This is good. So... No, uh, no, no, uh, no stronghold, but we find a zombie spawner. That's pretty cool. What's in the chest? <gasps> An enchanted apple. That'll be helpful. A golden apple. And, uh, the rest, I think, can stay. I'll take the piece of bread, though. Uh, I'm fine with that. Okay, do you hear that? You might be able to hear it. Yeah, yeah, you might. You just might. That is a zombie knocking on a door. And I think it just broke it down. Oh, oh my goodness, this lag is insane. What? I don't know what this world, oh, I don't know what's wrong with this world. I've got to get this problem diagnosed. I can't even see. Okay, 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 guys, do you see that? That is, oh, that's brick. That's brick right there. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 man. Let's get this water out right now. I think I'm safe here. I think I'm safe. So this is the way up. I'm just going to put two, a few torches there. That's how I signify it needs. That's the way out. That's the exit. My heart is racing right now. Guys, I've got to tell you something. Hey, 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 hey. Um, I've never fought the Ender Dragon in, in, in a survival world. I've never, I, even in the last, the last series, I never fought a boss. I went the whole time without fighting the Wither or the Ender Dragon. And here I am. I was talking with my friend. I'll, I'll, I'll give you guys a little story, a little backstory while I'm here. I was talking with my friend. Uh, his name is Jack, also, which is kind of funny. Oh, hey, buddy. How's it going? See ya. Um... And, and I was talking with him, and he thought it was hilarious. I never, I've never played a legitimate survival, and this is nuts. Oh, Hey, guy. And I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. Yeah, there we go. Looting sword uh, does the trick, so I've got an extra ender pearl here. Let's uh, let's continue on with the story. With the story that I was talking about. So my boy Jack, we were talking, and we were ta we were talking basically. And I never, and I've never, uh, I've never fought the dragon. I've also done a few building episodes. Hey, an emerald. And I'll take that horse armor as well. So um, uh, yeah, I, I just thought, you know, what's stopping me? Why why won't I? I'm definitely prepared. Why not just do it? So, we're just doing it. We're just doing it. <laughs> Another chest right here, and...